If you want to edit a specific part of your image or cut out a background, you need to understand how to select something. So I've opened up this image here showing three pairs, and I also have a layer underneath it showing a simple blue background. If you look to the left, you'll see a bunch of symbols stack up on each other top of each other. This is your toolbar. This first one is your move tool and below that are three different selection tools. You can right click them to see even more tools. Right click here and select the polygonal lasso tool. This tool works by making a series of points around your subject. Left click to create a point, move your mouse, and click again to create another. When you connect the last point to the starting point you should see a moving line like this. If you need to restart, you can try again by pressing Ctrl or Command D to deselect. After you've selected something, you can add more to the selection by holding down Shift and starting a new shape. You can also take away from the selection by holding down Alt. Now, equip your Move tool and hover over your selection. You can drag that part of the image and place it anywhere you'd like. You'll notice that we can now see through into the blue background from where the pair was. Let's say I want to separate those pairs and put them onto that blue background. To do this, we need to select just the pairs. To undo what you did, press Ctrl or Command Z repeatedly until you get back here. Because of the nature of this image, we can select these pairs very quickly by going up to Select Subject. Photoshop will try to select the subject of this image and it does so fairly accurately. From here, press Ctrl or Command J to separate the selection onto a new layer. Then we can go ahead and hide our original layer, which will give us this image.